Hey there, I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Welcome to TCM, where throughout July on Friday nights, we've been featuring stars of the 1970s. We have reached the end of the line. Up next, our final hosted film of the series from 1974, Freebie and the Bean. Alan Arkin and James Kahn star as a mismatched pair of San Francisco police detectives. They're out to nail a racketeer, but their constant bickering and antisocial behavior threaten to upend the entire operation. Freebie and the Bean is a precursor to the buddy cop movies that took off in the 1980s. It's filled with wild action scenes, clearly inspired by some of the biggest movies of the 70s, like The French Connection and The Seven Ups, a couple of Roy Scheider films, by the way. The result is a loud, noisy comedy that's not for the easily offended, with a car wreck total rivaling another film centered on a pair of misfits, The Blues Brothers, from 1980. The original Freebie and the Bean script was quite different. It's more of a drama. Director Richard Rush had the idea to rework it into a broad comedy, but quickly found he had his hands full with his two stars. Khan was already attached to the project, fresh from playing Sonny Corleone in The Godfather. He also starred in two excellent and relatively unheralded 70s dramas around that time, Cinderella Liberty from 73 and The Gambler, shot just after Freebie and also released in 74. Khan was hardly anyone's idea of a slam dunk comedy star. Rush was determined to cast Arkin, who made a mark in serious dramas, but also excelled at dark comedies, including Catch-22 from 1970 and Little Murders, which Arkin also directed. That was from 1971. A studio exec cautioned Rush to think twice about taking on the project with those two stars. Arkin had made it part of his routine, part of his method to irritate all the directors he'd work with, Rush said years later. And then he added, Khan was a follower. He'd do whatever he saw Arkin doing. It turned into a living hell for a while. Despite the stress, Rush recognized the chemistry the two actors had together and kept in much of their improvised banter, given the comedy its freewheeling, go-for-broke spirit. From Warner Brothers in 1974, also with Valerie Harper, Loretta Swit, Jack Crucian, and Alex Rocco. This is Freebie in the Bean.